Afghanistan witnessed a major regime change on August 15, 2021, as the U.S. withdrawal from the country completed. This sudden power shift has shaken the internal stability and security of the already war-ravaged country. Speaking about the current problems faced by Afghanistan, Mr. Gul Ahmad Kameen, former member of Parliament Afghanistan, says, Women are not allowed to go to work or uh, to go to school or universities. A big number. Those uh, women who are working in media are not allowed anymore to, to work. And of course, uh, uh, we don't have 30% uh, of media which we had before. There are lots of other problems which are arising. We are not in connection with the world anymore. Even our closest country, uh, our brother country, Pakistan, cannot support like lots of uh, legal problems. Discussing the looming migrant crisis, Mr. Kameen says, I really hope that we will not uh, go back 70s. I really hope we will not uh, repeat that history again. And I, I afraid that slowly we are going to that side. Like today we are issuing 16,000 visas. I hope uh, uh, one day should not come that uh, millions of Afghans will again uh, are standing in doors of Pakistan and crossing Pakistan. And I, I'm sure Pakistan is not in that situation to give place to a million people again because Pakistan is also having lots of problems. I hope that we will not repeat the uh, black history of 70s of Mujahideen time, you, you, uh, everybody knows that. And we are going to that side. Shedding light on the economic problems faced by Afghanistan, he added, On the ground, the reality is different. Uh, there is no system. Purchasing power of Af Afghan people are becoming zero. And if purchasing power is zero, then as we discuss uh, about the trade, is uh, of um, uh, no need for that because uh, no one can purchase anything. Proposing a way forward, Mr. Kameen highlighted the significance of international recognition of the newly established regime in Afghanistan. Do we pr put pressure on Taliban instead? Uh, U.S. and other countries are closing their uh, relations with Taliban, then it means that we should wait for another group to rise and fight against them. Uh, and that will take again 10 to 20 years, and again the same history will repeat. It is high time for the world to let go of political and diplomatic biases and take immediate action to resolve the problems faced by Afghanistan as the current ignorance of the world towards one of the worst humanitarian crises will make the lives of Afghans further miserable.